Hey there, art lovers. Welcome back to this art, the channel where we dive into the world of amazing artists and their incredible artworks. Today, we're going to explore the works of the talented Alfred Munnings. Alfred James Munnings was a renowned English painter, famous for his exquisite portrayal of horses and his strong criticism of modernism. He gained recognition and wealth through prestigious commissions after the Great War. Let's start with The Landscape by Alfred James Munnings. This painting captures the beauty of nature with its vibrant colors and serene atmosphere. It's like stepping into a peaceful oasis. Next up, we have Study of a Hunter Rufus. Munnings showcases his attention to detail in this piece, capturing the strength and grace of the horse. You can almost feel the power emanating from the canvas. Moving on to Study 4, Nothing Venture. This artwork gives us a glimpse into Munnings' creative process. It's a preliminary study for one of his famous equestrian paintings, showcasing his meticulous planning and composition skills. Now, let's take a look at Trees by the Edge of a Field. Munnings' love for nature shines through in this piece. The way he captures the play of light and shadow on the trees is simply breathtaking. In Exercising the Horses, Munnings brings the energy and movement of horses to life. You can almost hear the thundering hooves and feel the wind rushing past as they gallop across the canvas. Moving on to Study of the Decorations in the Mall for the Coronation of George VI. This painting showcases Munnings' versatility as an artist. He captures the grandeur and splendor of the decorations with his masterful brushstrokes. Now, let's admire a lady riding a bay hunter. Munning's ability to capture the elegance and poise of the rider is truly remarkable. It's a beautiful portrayal of the bond between humans and horses. Next, we have Phyllis Crocker. Munning's attention to detail is evident in this portrait. He captures the personality and essence of the subject, bringing her to life on the canvas. Moving on to an extensive view of Exmoor. Munning's love for landscapes is showcased in this piece. The vastness of the scenery and the play of colors create a sense of tranquility and awe. Now, let's explore the Pyrenees and the Plain of Tarp. Munning's skill in capturing the beauty of mountains and valleys is evident in this artwork. It's like a window into a breathtaking landscape. In A Pollard Willow, Munning showcases his ability to find beauty in simplicity. The delicate branches of the willow tree are brought to life with his masterful brushstrokes. Moving on to Landscape Study. Munning's love for the outdoors is evident in this piece. He captures the essence of the landscape with his vibrant colors and expressive brushwork. Next, we have, Study of a Racehorse with a Stable Lad. Munning's passion for horses shines through in this painting. He captures the bond between the horse and the stable lad, showcasing their mutual trust and companionship. Now, let's admire, Study of a Dog for Lady Munning's on Grey Hunter. Munning's attention to detail is evident in this piece. He captures the loyalty and affection of the dog, bringing a sense of warmth to the painting. Lastly, we have, an extensive view of Exmoor. Munning's love for landscapes is showcased once again in this artwork. The vastness of the scenery and the play of colors create a sense of wonder and serenity. And that concludes our journey through the artworks of Alfred Munnings. We hope you enjoyed this exploration of his incredible talent. Stay tuned for more amazing artists and their artworks on this art.